Hey everyone, welcome back to another Lightroom tutorial and as you can see we're looking at some more warm travel photos. So you guys can go give her a follow down in the description if you like her work. So coming down you can see these greens are quite warm the entire image. It's quite a warm cast and we're going to be working with this image right here. So links in the description guys and we're going to get into Lightroom and see if we can create something like this. As you can see, here's our image from her Instagram and the unedited image. So we have already cropped this into a 4x5 for Instagram and slightly straightened the horizon. So with an image like this, the first thing I want to do is uh, really warm it up. So it already gets us pretty far, but it's kind of obvious that we just warmed it up so we're gonna to touch it up a tad so it's quite a flat image meaning there's not a lot of contrast the blacks are quite bright And there's not a lot of shadows so I'm gonna bring these up I'm going to really flatten it out and then try to add in some contrast with uh, this curve here. So in this curve with the whites and blacks faded. So I only put a very slight amount of contrast in with this curve, very slight S curve because I'm going to do quite a bit of red, green and blue and that's going to also give a strong amount of contrast. So it's just an S curve and try to make it pretty much match up on the red channel, blue channel and the green channel all the same. So that's our curves done. So there's the before and after. For that, I'm just gonna desaturate those greens. And there's yellows. So we're looking not too bad. Uh, I'm gonna do some quick colors down here you might be why am I moving these she's helped me out a bit in this edit gave me some guidelines to follow so you don't have to move these ones here you can do it all on the hsl sliders but sometimes it's good to just get it somewhere in the ballpark of what you want and then touch it up in hsl So I just want to change the hue.
So these greens here can be a bit more uh, warmer. Not a lot of aquas, you can see there's a little down there. I'm going to move the blues to the teals. Can't see much in this image, but definitely a very popular way of uh, doing travel images. Same with desaturating the blues. And not many magentas and purples, but just bring them down to match up similar to the other ones in case you were using this on another image and they became very saturated. So luminance, brightness, and deepness of colors. Going to deepen these oranges and you quite often want to do that for skin tones And I think Lightroom's default for sharpening is now 40. I'm just going to bring that up a tad maybe. Uh, grain a little bit. Bringing up the size. Now, uh, vignetting. So, she's quite nicely framed this image uh, with the bushes here. So, I think a vignette would also add to that framing. So, just a little bit will help. So, here's the before and after of the vignetting. Very subtle, but very subtly helps frame that image and one thing I want to do is slightly ease up on these warm greens make them a bit more a natural green and I'm pretty happy with that so, is that before and after? So, that's it guys. So, comment down below who you want to see, but make sure they don't have too many followers on Instagram. That way I can reach out to them and they will send in a photo for me to do a tutorial on. So, yeah. Comment down below guys. Let me know what you think. And I'll be seeing you guys in the next one.